Hello guys and welcome to episode 2 of Project Paphos. Now on the last series we ended up uh, winning the first leg of the Coca-Cola Cup. Since then we've played two games. We've played a fir our first league game and we've also played that second leg of that Coca-Cola Cup. Let me take you to the screen and show you how we got on. So yeah, unfortunately it was a win and a defeat. Uh, let's show you. So would help if I press the right buttons. Uh, so yeah, so um, we played Kamatisa. Kamatisa, a very good side, but a side really that we should be beating with the players that we've got. Uh, and we did. We won three one at home. It was a bit of a tricky first half, really. We um, we started off with a four one four one, attacking four one four one as well. Um, and it was just because I wanted to. I still wanted to attack, but I also wanted that back up as well. Uh, and it was our first game. I just wanted to get into it and and slowly get into it. See see what the players were going to do in the first league game. It didn't really happen in the first half, and and to be fair with it, with a with a tactic that I had, I just wanted to see get into it calmly, you know, calmly and 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 chicole, really. Um. So yeah. So I changed it up in the second half. I went straight four four two. I brought on two strikers, Dennis Rakels and Hepburn Murphy. Now Hepburn Murphy is going to be an absolute fantastic player for this save. He is a he's an ex Aston Villa player, as we like mentioned in episode one, but. He ended up bagging an hat trick. Now, honestly, the two goals he scored was absolutely fantastic, and then and at the end he bagged a uh, an hat trick. Uh, he bagged a penalty as well, which is absolutely fantastic. Honestly, he came on and absolutely just dominated the game um, from start to finish. Really, ended up getting an eight point four in the end as well with three goals from half time. So yeah, it was um, a very good victory that. And then unfortunately, we did end up getting beat two nil off uh, Olympia Nicosia, but we was we was already five one up in the first leg. So and. Nobody really played the best, to be fair. We kept Epburn Murphy off, we kept Velikari off, we kept Kaveda, Kaveda off as well, Kaveda off, sorry. So, we listen, the, the job was done, the job was done. And unfortunately, it does mean defeat, it does go on Mitali, of course, as, as a defeat, but the, the, the goal was to get through to that second round, we did. Now, we have been drawn against Alke in the second round, um, and again, it should be really a tie that we are going to... Uh, they are they are like a second division side, so we are going to potentially go through there without a doubt as well. But anyway, I won't count my chickens too early. Uh, so guys, we are going. We've got two games coming up today. We're going to be playing Apollon Limassol, and we're going to be playing Nia Salamina. Now, Nia Salamina are a team kind of similar to Paphos, so it's going to be a really good game that one. But the Apollon Limassol is going to be a tough game, uh, and we are away as well. So, without further ado, guys, let's get to that first game again. Apollon uh, Limassol. And let's see how we go. Also, guys, I forgot to tell you, we have made a new signing. So we have brought three signings in up to now. We have brought in uh, Jack Vale on loan. Unfortunately, he's currently injured at the minute. We've brought in Ashley Williams on a free transfer, uh, just for experience and a bit of guile in, in that defensive centre as well with uh, with uh, Azure. And then um, and then we've just brought another player in called Zay Carlos. Now, Zay Carlos is a very versatile um a very versatile player is he's uh he can play all up the right hand side more or less and he can actually play on the left as well as a bit of an IW. Uh so yeah, a very good player and um like I said, he's on loan from Braga at the minute. You never know we might be able to get over, but if you look at his physical attributes, he's pretty good. His mentals are quite standard across the board. Maybe need to work a little bit more on his technical, but apart from that, physical's mentals really good. And yeah, I'm very happy with that, guys. I'm very happy with that loan signing. Uh, 22 years old, Zay Carlos. Right, guys, now let's get to the first game against Apollon Limassol. So, guys, this is the team that we're going in against Limassol against. Now, I've gone with this formation just because I think that it's it's it, we're going in cautious first of all. Uh, I think it's the right thing to do. We're playing away against a very good side here, and we're going to see how we get on. We potentially could go to a flat four four two. Let's see how the game goes on from here. Uh, but we are going with uh, Velarenos, Williams, Azuri, and Zay Carlos. The new player Zay Carlos on that right back role. We're going Panic as a DM. We're going Punchin and four as we've got. I'm putting four as an automatic CM just because I think he can. But he can do. He can do a lot of things really. So I'm going to put him as auto for now. And then we're going with uh, attacking Kusik. We're going the supporting winger of Aurelio. Uh, Aurelio. And then uh, we're going with up top uh, attacking with. Epburn Murphy. Guys, absolutely buzzing. We've got a very strong bench as well in Camillo Size, Oliver Omivericare, we've got uh Barrigade, uh Kavida, Rakels, 
Wow, very strong side we have got here. So uh, guys, very happy with this. Let's get into this save. Let's get into this game, sorry, not save. Let's get into this uh, game and let's see how we do against Limassol. So here we go, guys. Uh, I have done the opposition, um, I have done the opposition um, tactics as well, so uh, we should be good there. We should be all right. I have faith in you guys, definitely. I have faith, I have faith. Composed, seem motivated. Okay, I'm happy. Um, as your lack of match fitness, how long will it last out there? You know what? He's good to go. He is good to go. There's no doubt about it. He had a slight injury. Uh, could you talk about uh, how, how important he is to... We're stronger with having him, without a doubt. We're stronger with having Zay, uh, Zay Carlos. Very good signing. Like I said, I've got him on loan at the minute and potentially get him on a, on, on, a, on a permanent, really. Stangner tries to whip it in. Gets tucked away. Is that the Stangner? Is that the Stangner? I don't think it is, is it? Let me just double check. It is the Sagna, it is Bakari Sakura, no way. He's gone on a free from Montreal Impact, Wowzers. So we've got Sagna, uh, Sagna, Sagna at the back. Their right back, ex Arsenal player, of course. Kept Cave tries to put it in. Gets dealt away. You know what? I'm going to come away from Cautious. I'm going to go to Balance at the minute. I think we've got a good enough side to actually do some damage here. Then it puts it in. Is Sagma, Sagma to Yeast. And it's away. Can it be Murphy try and grind it? He's up there on his own at the minute, but we have got a couple of supporting wingers there that can help him out. Get across there, get across. Away. Oh, Markovic. So we're not doing too bad. 10 minutes in. Um, it's, it's tit for tat at the minute to be fair, uh, it's not too bad, 56% possession actually for, for us at the minute, so we're not doing too bad. A uh, little encouraged shout going out I think. We're doing, we're doing okay, let's, uh, oh wait. Okay, I spoke too early didn't I? <laughs> Nicholas Diguini, Diguini scores there for Apollon to make it 1-0 Apollon. Listen, it's going to be it's gonna be a tough game, it's going to be a tough game, there's no doubt about it. Um, but we'll see how we get on. Like I said, I could go to that 4-4-2. Uh, in the second half and try and push on for some goals, of course. But let's uh, let's just see what we can do with this formation at the minute. That does put us into ninth position at the minute. Of course, it's very early stages yet. We did start the uh, did start the game first, of course, but uh, it doesn't work like that. Just after two games, forty minutes in. Let's do a little encourage shower again going out. Um, okay, listen, it is what it is, guys. We have been dominated we was expecting that there's no doubt about it um let's see we're going to change it up a little bit we're going to change it up a little bit just see what we can do so we're going to go to positive let's go to the dressing room first tell the lads you know it is what it is <laughs> um look you know uh, uh, show me what we, yeah let's see what we can do in the second half let's see what we can do i do have faith in him uh, i have faith in him so i'm gonna um i'm not delighted uh i have faith in you definitely without a doubt i think that's the right the right wording uh for this moment at the minute Okay, we're going to give it five minutes and then we're going to look at a couple of changes. Okay, Aurelio away. Aurelio with the corner. Whips it in. Gets knocked away. Villacaris picks up. Panic. Panic to punch him. Punch him to Aurelio. Aurelio, can we get in? Oh, wow. What a save that was. What a save that was from Apollon's goalkeeper. Wowzers. Okay, let's make a couple of changes. So we, we, we have started. Started really positive. We're doing a lot better now. Um, XG starts to go up a little bit, even though it's still quite poor on both sides, really. Uh, we're going to try and fire it up. And also what we're going to do, we are going to change it up completely, tactical-wise. So we're going to go with recalls coming on. Four is coming off. We're going to go with recalls and Hepburn up top. We're going to go with uh, Panic as a bit of a DLP instead. Supporting DLP. Punching support. And we're going to go... Advanced player maker for it, advanced player more. We're going to go attacking winger for Aurelio. Bit of a talk for Regals. Let's confirm that sub. Right, here we go. Positive. Two up top. We have got a couple of other cards we need to look out for. Is it Carlos? Is on the other card as well. Hepburn Murphy. Hepburn Murphy. Can he go all the way? Can he go all the way? Oh, what a save that was. Unlucky Hepburn Murphy. Come on. Gets knocked in, went right through everyone, and I couldn't believe that. It went right through everyone, and it's a well, well defended there from Z Carlos. Come on, Pathos, come on. 
XG starting to go up now for us. We're doing all right. We're doing good. Let's uh, little demand more shout. We're doing good though. To be fair, I'm not probably won't demand more actually. Maybe a little fire up shout going out. Okay, there's already a yellow card. Gotta be careful with these yellow cards. I might. Uh... Okay, seventy first minute. Let's have a quick look at the instructions. Um, everything's fine at the minute. I tell you what we can do because we've got because we have got Aurelio on that uh, Aurelio and Zero uh, Z Carlos on that right hand side. Let's focus down that right hand side. Let's do a bit of overlapping. Let's take away play for thingy. Let's start running defense. We're gonna go for this. We're gonna go for it. We'll stay positive. We won't go attacking. We'll just stay positive. Uh, let's push these guys up a little bit. Everything else is fine. Let's get, reduce that intensity slightly by taking them options off. Okay, let's see what we can do here now. Aurelio whips it in, gets knocked away. Can we pick it up? We do. Here's Villarenos. Villarenos to Williams. Williams to Panic. Panic over to Aurelero. Aurelero, can he do something? A penalty. Get in, it's got to be. It's not a penalty. <gasps> you are kidding me. That was a blatant penalty. Get across. That was a blatant penalty, guys. Wow, go back to that and have a look at that, guys. That was that was shocking. Absolutely shocking refereeing. To be fair, good goal there from Apollon, but that was just, that was, from where we were, was actually going to get then as well. Markovic. Wow. A little demand more shout going out. Oh, gutted, absolutely gutted. I thought I was going to get something there then, without a doubt. Aurelio whips it in, gets knocked away again. Again, we can't beat that first man. We're going to have a look at corners soon. Larson's in here, one on one, and he hits the outside of the post and it goes wide. I'm going to make a sub here, guys. Let's make a sub. We'll probably bring Barricade on. In fact, we'll bring uh, we'll bring uh, Velakari on and Barricade for Hepburn Murphy. And we're going to go to attacking. We're going to give it a go. We're going to have to give it a go. Last couple of minutes. Can we get a counter attack here? Away, punchins away, and here's Barricade. Barricade. It's three on three. It's three on two. Can we get across there? Can we get across? Barricade whips it in, gets knocked away. Again, that knock away again with the, the counter attack happening. Three minutes to go. It's, it's not looking likely now at all. Again, it was a tough game. Tough game. Ref, we're not having a free kick there. Oh, great save there from Rudko. Great save there from Rudko. And that is it, guys. That is it. Unfortunately, it is a 2 what, two nil defeat. Uh, and it was expected. It was expected, to be fair. But I did want to try and... Listen, we did okay in the end. 13 shots, 6 on target. Uh, Possession-wise, 62%. We just could not do anything with that 62%. Um, listen, it is what it is, guys. We go on. Panic had a pretty good game. But apart from that, everyone else was below 7. <sighs> XG wasn't the best for both sides, really. It's one of them, guys. Listen... We understand we've won our first game in the league. We've lost our second game in the league. Let's go to that next game now against Salamina. Gutted. I'm absolutely gutted about. It. Okay. Um. I'm not. I'm not going to play. I'm not happy. I'm just going to say unlucky, boys. It just wasn't. Wasn't our win today. Simple as that. And what. What. What that's done. It's just uh, made them motivated. Pretty. Pretty good. Looked inspired and motivated. All good. Okay. Let's get to that next game, guys. Anyway. Right, guys. I'm going into this next game against Famagusta. Different. Completely different in a way. Uh, I'm kind of going with a flat three now in midfield instead of having a DM role in, in uh, Panic. I'm, I'm putting four now as a DLP. DLP is a very good DLP actually for. So I put D I put uh, four in the centre. Panic and punch on either side of him. I'm also bringing on Scottish player uh, Velikari as well. Omni Velikari. A very good, I'll just show you Velikari actually very quickly. Uh, he, he's a good player. He's a, he's a good all-rounder tribute player and he's only 21 years old as well so yeah I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to the future of this guy his potential ability is five star as well so yeah very good uh Edburn murphy up front again uh, i was thinking of changing him because he didn't perform in the last game but i'll give him another chance for now uh because he, he is a fire player and then obviously we've got barricade on the bench and obviously ray calls if needs be we can go again we can change up and go to a flat 442 let's see how we get on against femagusa here um i think that we should we, we, we should be a lot better here. We should be a lot better in this game. Um, it's not going to be easy though, no, no doubt about it. Femagusa are currently second as well at the minute. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's certainly not an easy start to this uh, this episode, without a doubt. Uh, we should be winning this. I'm not going to say that. It's all up to you. Have a good night out there. That's all I'm going to say. Um, I have faith in you. I, I always have faith in you because you do get your, you can, you know, you're composed or... Uh, 
a little bit appreciative or anything like that. So yeah, it's a let's go. Come on now, come on the pathos. Let's get a win in this uh, in this episode, please. Come on. So we've had two losses on the bounce at the minute, guys. Of course, we had the second leg of the Coca Cola Cup, uh, a defeat two 0 and then we just got beat two 0 again off uh, Apollon. So yeah, it's not the best start to this uh, this episode. Okay, we are 15 minutes in, uh, 16 minutes in actually, so we've had one shot each, a bit of a boring game to be honest, pretty, uh, very equal, very equal. 20 minutes in now. 20 minutes in, nothing really happening, a little encouraged shout going out. Uh, our shots now are starting to come in, uh, they are starting to, but we've had three yellow cards already. Let's have a quick look at what instructions we have got. I might just come away from getting stuck in, try and stay on feet for a minute, try and reduce any other cards. 39 minutes and 44 wow wowzers half, half time and there is no highlight wowzers we might have to uh, put the highlights on uh, on extended highlights since the, this second half uh, okay guys nothing really nothing really to worry about too much obviously we've, we've got quite a few yellow cards in there uh, probably have to may, uh, maybe have to change one maybe maybe in 10 minutes or so uh, maybe give it a, give it a, give them a chance anyway give them a chance um but three shots each, uh, nothing really to uh, to rave about really, to be fair. Her pass is complete, I hit 1%. 50-50 uh, more or less possession wise. Let's go into the second, let's get into the change room first. Um, we've been the better side there just, yeah. Let's keep going, I think we'll be fine. I think that's right to say. Um, there's a lot more to come from you, that's what I'm going to say on these. There's a lot more to come. Okay, seem motivated. Okay, a couple seem motivated, composed. Okay, let's see what we can do in the second half. Here's Varala, Varala for, for Magusa and it gets knocked away, here's Zay, Zay Carlos, Zay Carlos, 50 minutes in, can we get something here, Zay Carlos, going all the way down the wing, gets it knocked in, he gets knocked in, oh, wow, unbelievable there, unlucky that from Villacare, it's a free kick here, Jason punched with a free kick, and it hits the wall, nearly kills a man actually, <laughs> from Magusa guy just went straight down there, straight to the floor, 59 minutes in here, come on now, Little fire up shout going out. Sixty three minutes in, might have to take a couple of them, a uh, couple of them yellow cards off now. So we'll go Carlos size coming off for Derek, uh, Ashley Williams, and then we're gonna go with four in the centre midfield. We're gonna push it on a little bit now. Put Berrigade up up top. Yeah, we'll go Ber Berrigade up top. Uh, cancel that a minute. Supporting Aurelio. Come on now. Let's uh, let's bring it on here now. Come on, Pathos. Come on, we can do it. So we've dropped down to eight for the minute. Here's Velarenos. Velarenos with a free kick. Gets knocked in. Gets knocked away. We should be able to pick that up when we do. Panic picks it up. Here's Panic. Panic to Velarenos. Free kick? No. Nope. And we get knocked out. The counter's on here. Counter's on here for Famagusta. It's just to a side here's Wagner, Wagner to a side. Great tackle there, absolute fantastic tackle there from Villarenos. Absolute fantastic tackle. On the yellow card as well, sliding tackle in that. Here's Villarenos. Villarenos with a long throw in, gets knocked away. Comes out to Derek Williams. Ashley Williams keeps saying Derek because he's a Blackburn Rovers player, Derek Williams. Here's Villarenos. Villarenos to punch him, punch him, whips it in. Oh. He gets knocked away. Okay, I'm going to go to attacking. No, positive I'm going to go to. 77th minute. Here's Aurelio, Aurelio with the throw in to Panic, Panic back to Aurelio. Aurelio, what can you do? Plays it outside to Williams. Williams with a shot, and again Williams. Just not got that technique to uh, keep it down. From a good keeper, knocks it out from the goal kick. To Carlos, to nobody really. Can you put a bit of pressure on him? He, he, he does, but he doesn't get anything from it. Gets not too easy. Carlos is out of position, but uh, that's well... Uh, well thought, here goes Zay Carlos. Zay Carlos is in here. Zay Carlos with a shot. It's certainly happening now, guys. It's certainly happening now. Jason punching here. Tapped it to work in. Punching with a free kick and punching with an absolutely amazing goal. Jason punching makes it 1 0 Pathos. What a goal that was, guys. Must have been at least 30 yards out there. Get in there. What a free kick from Jason punching. Oof. Oof. What a free kick that is, guys. Jason punching makes it 1 0 Pathos. 81st minute, okay. 
absolutely fantastic. A little praise going out. You can see here at the bottom here where all the all the, the moral faces are. You'll see now after this praise, we've gone one nil up, you'll see now they all start going green. Maybe, maybe they better do. Here's Aurelio. Aurelio with a long throw into Williams. Williams should be able to get that. It does. It doesn't get over their keeper though. Okay, we're gonna to have to make a make a change. I think we're gonna make a change in the yellow cards. We certainly picked up now. Here's Velikari. Velikari. Velikari with a shot. Unlucky. Only Velikari. Unlucky. Okay, let's make a change. And I think it is going to be. I think it is going to be Velikari actually, for a Kusik. So Velikari for Kusik, and we'll bring Velarenos, who's had a pretty good game to be fair. Six point nine, but he's had a good game uh, for Kavida. Okay. We've made the substitutions. Come on, boys. Come on. We can do this. 90th minute. Three minutes to go, guys. Can we get another win in the league here? And we have. Get in there. Away, Rudko. Away. Don't mess it up. We're going to get another goal? No? That's it, guys. That is it. Get in there. Get in there. That's a, that's a good win, that. A good win against a similar side to us. Um, very happy with that. Jason Punchin, man of the match. Get in there, Jason Punchin. Edburn Murphy, not too happy with uh, Edburn Murphy's performance there, but listen, it is what it is, it is what it is. Guys, thank you very much today for watching this episode. If you do like it, please hit that subscribe button. If you like it even more, you can hit the like button as well, that would be even better. Guys, thank you very much. I will see you on episode three on Tuesday. Take care.